Movies are like icebergs. What we see on the big screen is only to tip. There are a lot more things beneath the surface. They call it deleted scenes. In this video, we will explore the most important deleted scenes from Marvel movies that will make you think, damn, how could they delete it? At the end of this video, you might just find your new favorite scene. Let's dive in. Remember the interesting of Captain America the Rangers? We saw him training in the gym with a boxing bat. But what if I tell you that was the end of the actual scene? They deleted 90% of that before going to training. He was in a room watching his documentary from World War II, and then he looks at a file that shows the status of Bucky Barnes. How are Stark Tony and Peggy Carter? He saw Bucky missing in action after he fell down to training the first movie, but Peggy Carter is alive and retired. Steve saw his phone number there, but he decided not to call her. He was not sure how she would react to seeing him after all these years. Then he goes out to a cafe drawers. The building's on a paper talks to a waitress, and there's a Stanley Kimmy over here. After that, he goes to the gym that we saw in the movie, and we see he actually paid for the gym and started working out. You know the rest of the story. Okay, this is not actually a deleted scene, but you probably didn't see this in the movie. In Captain America, the Winter Soldier here, Sam Wilson recommends Steve to a movie. He gets his notebook and writes it down. These scenes shows us that he keeps a list of things he doesn't know or miss. Steve Jobs, moon landing, rocking Nirvana. Just go. Okay, if you watch it in United States or in most of the world, you probably saw this list. However, these list changes for some countries. They add a check here for Latin America. So we have the solution for Russia World Cup for Italy and so on. You can pause to read it if you want there. But there's a need more said that they didn't want Captain America to be a hero just for America. They wanted him to be the hero for the entire war. And they chose these notes with the help of the world. They asked a list of questions online for each region, and the top five answers got the final movie in that country. I think it's a great example of how even the smallest detail can make a big difference in telling a story. Hey, if you're enjoying the video, you can support my work by liking this video. It helps the channel grow to love. Thank you. Now back to the video in Spider-Man Homecoming. During their trip to Washington, D.C., we were supposed to see a brief scene referencing Captain America, the Winter Soldier. As you remember, after Captain America escaped the S.H.I.E.L.D. headquarters, he broke some part of the building and the helicopter's experiments deleted scene, Peter Nett. See that building destroyed and talk about why would Captain escape? It was just a nice 20-second scene referencing that connection. They probably removed it because it doesn't add something to the story. In Infinity War's final battle, that is use the Soul Stone to extract the Soul of Guardians of the Galaxy, and Peter Parker was there to help them get back to their bodies. That has did the same to Doctor Strange, but he used astral traveling like he did before to reach Peter and help him bring the souls to their body. Spider-Man at first sight man is the Nebula, Quill and Drax. Doctor String said Mantis can fix them with their powers, but she had no idea how to do that. At the end, she figured it out and save others. But as you know, they cut up this scene entirely from the final movie because they thought it would just make a chaotic scene even more complex, but we still have an unfinished version of. Even though things look a bit weird, it gives us an idea of how it would be if they added to the film. Now you know how important the visual effects are in science fiction movies. In Thor Ragnarok, we stall door and lock, has seen the father for the last time in Norway. Right after audience, that hill cops destroyed Milner, and they go to Aska. But in the deleted version of the scene, they're meeting in a random street who were unlucky, find Odin in a completely different situation here. He tells him Aska is not a real place. Ragnar on the hill are common. Then he gives the thunder power to Thor and makes him the king. After that, Hela comes in, kills Odin, and destroys me owner. So why did they remove it and shut another version. Their reason is, again, the test of the director Taika Waititi says, when they showed the movie to a test audience, they said Odin's story should not end like that. And after that reaction to the scene that we saw in the final movie, to be honest, I like the final version and the way they finish out in store. Okay, that was it for this video. If you liked it, you should watch this one too. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.